Certainly if this washed up on shore 50 years ago, people would be screaming extraterrestrial, but thanks to science, we know it's a whale. In fact, it's two of them. I'm Michael McCrudden talking about one whale of a tail here for you on IO. A pair of conjoined gray whales washed up on the shore of Mexico in what is likely the first documented case of Siamese twin gray whales. Scientists discovered the dead calves and it is their belief that the twins were miscarried due to their disability. Conjoined twins have happened before, they've documented it happening to sea, fin and mink whales, but never before have we seen a gray whale or two gray whales stuck together. The carcass is 7 feet long, the average newborn gray whale 12 to 16 feet, so obviously this baby was aborted before it even had a chance to give it a go. Just imagine if this specimen had made it a mature gray whale, it can grow up to be as much as 40 tons. This would have been like two put together, so maybe make about 75 tons of absolute awesomeness. It would have been the king of the sea. Now it is unknown if the mother survived the birthing of these Siamese twins. I'm certain there was only this much room to get it out and she probably pulled the chute when it was kind of at maximum capacity. She's ready to give birth to one, not two. She's not built for that. And there's just not a lot of doctors in the sea ready to perform whale cesarean sections, unfortunately. Unfortunately, they didn't make it, but if you want more information, you can check out the links down below. I wanna know, if you were to see a two-headed animal, what animal would you wanna see? My name is Michael McCrudden, and I think I would put my money on seeing a two-headed giraffe. That'd be a lot of head.